hey guys welcome to coding simplified and today we'll see that how to check whether two binary trees are identical or not so basically identical means we are checking that they should be exactly same so if i put a another binary tree on top of the this binary tree so it should not be visible right means each node should be each node should be same right so if if it is two then the another binary tree root should be two then if it is seven then it should also be seven right so each node should be match now uh, so what we have done basically we have created a binary tree first now the same binary tree we have created for the root right so this is another binary tree and this is previous binary tree and now we are checking that check if identical and here we are passing root one and root two right so now let's see what should be our logic right so our logic will be that first we'll check that first we'll pass from the root and we'll check that whether whether root should be uh, whether t1 and t2 should be null if it is null then we'll return true right because if both are null then they are true but if any one of them is null it means it is false right so let's say if t1 is null and t2 is full tree then it means they are not identical right so logic is that we'll check the data that whether data is matching or not and then recursively we'll call them left and then right right so basically we, we are using here the pre-order functionality that first we we are checking that component the node component and then you are traversing to the left and then you are traversing to the right right so like what you will do we'll check that first this root component is matching or not if it is matching then check if left is matching or not then go again left check if left is matching or not then again it will go here so for both the trees we'll traverse the element uh, same right so when we are passing the left then we will check both lefts when we are passing right then we'll check the both right component right so if you see here so this is our function and here we are checking that if t1 equals to null and t2 equals to null then return true it means both are same and if if this is not true and if this is true it means this is false right it means that any of tree is null and the another tree is not null means the components are not matching right so it will return false else what you do else you will check the data of both the component both the nodes and then you will pass the left one t1 dot left and t2 dot left and then you will pass the right component t1 dot right and t2 dot right right so if you do it recursively it will solve your problem it will give you answer that whether they are identical or not so let me show you by running the program so let's debug it so first it will go here and here we are passing t is 2 1 and t2 is also 2 so it will say yes both data are matching then it will go in left right so right is 7 and d2 is also 7 so again it will check yes both are matching and it will again pass into left one so again it will check for 2 right so recursively now it will go in left which are null so basically both are null right so it will return true now it will go for right right is also null so it will return true so basically we are using the pre-order functionality and we are checking the data first then we are going left and then we are going right so this will make sure that each each data in both trees data are matching and they are identical right and at the last it will print in console that they are matching or not so you can see this is true but let's say that uh, the tree is not same right so let me just comment it so in this case the t2 is okay so now let's run it again so here uh, basically first elements are matching so this is fine now it will go in left now again the uh, 7 and 7 so until here it is fine and now when it will go left so now 
t1 is 2 right which is this one but t2 is null right so it will check here that yes this is not true so it will go here and now it will say that t1 is not null but t2 is null and then it will return false and the complexity of this problem is big of n because uh, basically both the trees we are traversing each node we are traversing once and uh, so that's it guys we have seen that how to check whether two trees are identical or not and uh, uh, if you have understood the problem or if you have any issue so please comment in the section and uh, subscribe the channel for more such videos thank you